welcome back to Sopna's math book today we can continue our lesson practical geometry previous class we discussed about how to construct a quadrilateral when the lengths of four sides and a diagonal are given today we can continue today we can study how to construct a quadrilateral when two sides and three diagonals are given we can do few questions from the textbook exercise 4.2 First question. Construct quadrilateral LIFT. LI is equal to 4 cm. IF is equal to 3 cm. TL is equal to 2.5 cm. LF is equal to 4.5 cm. IT is equal to 4 cm. Three diagonals and two sides are given. Now we can see how to construct quadrilateral LIFT. First, you have to draw the rough sketch. Quadrilateral LIFT. LIFT. And what is given? LI is equal to 4 cm. IF is equal to 3 cm. TL is equal to 2.5 cm. And LF is equal to LF, one diagonal, 4.5 cm. Then IT is equal to 4 cm. Then two sides and one, two diagonal, three sides and two diagonals are given. Now first we can draw a line. With radius 4 cm. Four centimeter radius. Length that is length. Li Li is equal to 4 cm. And first we can construct triangle LIF. Then now LF we know and uh, IF also we know so easily we can locate the point F so LF 4.5 cm so with center L draw an arc with 4.5 cm so take 4.5 cm and with center L draw an arc of radius 4.5 now then F is I 3 cm away from I. So with center O draw an arc with 3 cm radius. Okay. So this little have to draw a little. Now, now this is the point F. Now you can join I and F L and F also. Now, now we want the fourth point T. We have to locate the point T. For that, T is 2.5 cm away from L and T is 4, 4 cm away from I. So, you have to, you have to take 2.5 cm with center O, with center L, can draw. Then four centimeter away from I. With center O, draw an arc with four centimeter. Draw four centimeter. This you have to draw a little long. Then join, join the points. This one and uh, this is the point T. Join F and T also. 4 cm here, then here 3 cm. LT is 2.5 cm and LF is 4.5 cm and IT is 4 cm long. This is the required quadrilateral LITF. Okay.
hope you all understood second question construct quadrilateral g o l d o l is equal to 7.5 cm g l is equal to 6 cm g d is equal to 6 cm l d is equal to 5 cm o d is equal to 10 cm now we can see how to construct quadrilateral g o l d draw rough sketch first quadrilateral g o l d g o l d and what is given oil is equal to 7.5 cm then gl is equal to 6 cm gl means one diagonal 6 cm gd is equal to 6 cm another side ld is equal to 5 cm then od is equal to 10 cm 10 cm so first you have to construct old triangle old then first you have to draw ol with length 7.5 cm take 7.5 cm 7.5 and mark ol 7.5 then od is 10 cm and ld is 5 cm so with center o draw an arc of 10 cm radius with 10 cm radius with center o then then d is 5 cm away from l so with center l draw an arc of 5 cm radius with center l from here you have to draw this one first one little long okay this is the point d now you can join l and d ld is 5 cm and o and d o d is 10 cm now now we can find the point g for that dg we know 6 cm and gl also 6 cm gl is 6 cm and gd also 6 cm so g is 6 cm away from d so take 6 cm with center d with center d a radius draw an arc with radius 6 cm now gl is 6 cm gl also 6 cm again you can with center l take draw an arc with 6 cm radius from here draw an arc both 6 cm only this you have to draw it till now 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 you can jo join this is the point g now you can join o and g and g and d so o g is O G G we got O G then G D is six centimeter and G L is six centimeter. G L also six centimeter. It's given. This is the required quadrilateral G O L D. Hope you all understood. Third question. Construct rhombus B E N D. BN is equal to 5.6 cm DE is equal to 6.5 cm now we can see how to construct rhombus BE ND 
first you have to draw the rough sketch rhombus b e n d all sides are equal b e n d then bn is equal to 5.6 cm one diagonal 5.6 cm and de is equal to 6.5 cm two diagonals are given see as you all know diagonals of a rhombus are perpendicular bisectors of one another so perpendicular at a point o that means b o is equal to o n here b n is equal to 5.6 cm so b o is equal to half of the diagonal that is 5.6 divided by 2 that is 2.8 cm so b o is equal to o n is equal to 2.8 cm now now you can draw rhombus b e n d first you have to draw d e of length 5.6 of length 6.5 cm d e is 6.5 cm 6.5 de 6.5 cm now after that you have to draw the perpendicular bisector of de how we can draw you already learned from the previous classes with center e with center e more than half of radius you have to take then draw an arc up and down also same way with center d draw an arc with radius more than half of de down also this is the perpendicular bisector of de perpendicular bisector of de now we should find the find point p and n this is the perpendicular bisector at the point o then bo is 5 2.8 cm and on is equal to 2.8 cm so you have to take 2.8 cm radius then with center o draw an arc 2.8 cm length up and down then this is the point b and here n yeah, you can mark then join b and d then d and n then b and d e b and e and n this is the required rhombus b e n d hope you all understood we can do more questions in the next class practice well thank you